Coach Dom, can you tell me what's going on back there? Yeah, um, so it's a theatre show about my autoimmune disease. Okay, does it have a name? The, the play, not the disease. Your heart looks like a vagina. Okay, why is it called that? Um, I can't really tell you because it's the ending of the play. I feel like I want to know why it's called that. It's quite a provocative title. Can't I know? No, it'll ruin it and then no one will buy tickets. All right. <laughs> In a theatre, like, your new serious direction now, is it a thing? Nah, no, fuck no. So, do you get up to much of that stuff anymore? No, not really. Not since I got sick. I don't actually know all that much about your condition. How to come on? It starts with a pain in my neck like I slept funny. A joke compared to what's coming. I ignore it and limp to my job, a tiny kitchen. Sweat runs down my face like Jesus tears. Every dock at a crucified minute I could have spent pissing beneath the moon. I've lost 13 kgs and can barely walk. The nervous doctor whispers bowel cancer. I leave his office back to the room where I keep my mattress, feasting on Xanax, until eventually the test results come back negative and I'm once again cradled by the unknown. Let's talk about the disease. Does it have a name? Um, ankylosing spondylitis. Ankyl something. Ankylosing spondylitis is a bit of a mouthful. How does that affect your life, Dom? Pain and stiffness in the neck, back and lower spine that progressively worsens. Inflammation leads to scarring of the lungs and soul. Fused spines are particularly brittle and vulnerable to breakage like the hearts of idealists. Can you chuck the green light on? Loss of range of motion, loss of motivation, loss of the ability to manage your mood in social situations. You find yourself staring into the void, popping opiates, asking why tomorrow no longer returns your cause. I don't know, what do you guys think? How's the disease changed your life, Dom? Um, I guess I just do what I love now because it's too painful to do anything else. Long-term prognosis? No, who knows?